invite you to come into the church with me for a while today. In the famous parable of the Good Samaritan, a man was travelling on the road from Jerusalem to Jericho. And as he walked along that road, he was set upon by thieves and bandits. Those robbers took all he had. They took his money and they left him lying helpless. And as part of the parable, a Samaritan comes along the road, sees him and takes pity on him. He goes over towards him. He binds and washes his wounds with pours wine and oil onto them. He lifts them, lifts them onto his own animal and leads them to a nearby inn where he takes care of them. Saint Aloysius Gonzaga is remembered as a Jesuit of the 16th century. He was born into an Italian family, an aristocratic Italian family, but he renounced his wealth, his inheritance and his title to enter a strict religious life, he entered the Society of Jesus. He was still a student with them when plague broke out in Italy in 1590. The Jesuits did all they could, and Aloysius and others helped in a hospital called the Hospital of Santa Maria de Consolazione. In 1591, one day, Aloysius was walking along the, the street when he saw somebody, a man lying helpless, unconscious on the ground, a victim of the plague. He took pity on him. He carried him in his own arms back to the hospital. He washed him. He reclothed him. But Aloysius himself contracted the plague and became a victim of it. Today is Thursday and at 8pm many of us will be cheering or clapping for our NHS carers and other care staff working at the front line the Good Samaritans of today, may we pray that they will be kept safe. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you blessed the children who are brought to you. Watch over our young people, we pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you are the Good Shepherd and you are the light of the world. Shine into our hearts today. Lord Jesus Christ, you said, Abide in me, and I will abide in you. Dwell in our hearts by the power of your Spirit. And we ask God to bless all who are on the front line of care. Lord, keep them safe and protect them. In Jesus' name, Amen.